Hi guys, I'm Charlie. And I'm Brian. And you're watching 3 Minute View, Albany Leaks Golf Course, just outside of Brisbane. Hey, Albany Charlie. Links! Nice And we've just played Albany Links Golf Course here at Albany Creek, 15, 20 minutes from somewhere inside Brisbane North Side. It's around Brando, Albany Creek area. We paid 42 bucks. Yeah. 42 bucks for a car for about four hours and 18 holes. We'll probably play 27. Um, but first thought, I mean, I'm probably a little bit conflicted with my thoughts here because my first game of golf was here at this place in 1997. Uh, yeah. The set of Brosnan Mustang Golf Clubs in Brosnan, if you're watching. Send me a set of clubs. Um, Mustangs. Um, what would you think? I thought it was great. Like, it's not going to blow you away. It's not going to blow your socks off. This golf course serves a purpose. You're paying a cheaper price. What, fifteen dollars for eighteen holes? holes yeah. yeah, fifteen dollars for eighteen holes, and it's more. It's a smaller course, so it's more. You know, it's it's something that's not going to get in too much trouble. But you still got to hit your shots, and the greens are a bit undulated, and they're like your um, like a buffalo grass. And yeah. Like a like so a main fairway. Yeah, 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 yeah. like a main fairway. They yeah. bubble around, and they're sort of all on tees, and there's some there's some cool little layouts. The closest so, thing I'd say that it's almost like they'd be a average to good temporary green at other courses. Yeah. With and that's not being rude. That's just stating no, the and honest that's, truth. That's so. what this is. It doesn't have to be anymore. No. It doesn't have to be something else that it's not. This serves a purpose. We like playing. There's other types of courses, just as much as we like playing this. This is fun. But I tell you, I wouldn't take Christine, my wife, to play Gales, or I wouldn't Hope take her to play Hope Island and stuff like that because it's too intimidating. Yeah. I would take her to play here because your average hole is between 70 and 110 metres. Yeah. And, Jesus, even we struggle to make the greens here, and we yeah. play them. So, you're not going to make beginners, your mother, your dad, whoever you bring here, feel bad. But everyone's um, going to have a fun time because it's not too crazy, it's not too long, it's, it's fun. Yeah. yeah so. I mean, it's just. There's something about playing, for lack of a better term, I wouldn't call it a bogey course, just you don't feel like you need to dress up and be on show, have three M1s in the bag even though you're only using one. Yeah. Like... You, you can come in with three clubs in your hand and walk it and you'll yeah. be fine. That's right. And you improve your game because you're trying different shots. I mean, it, you, you, a three wood, a mid iron, a short iron and a putter and I think you'd be in half a dozen balls, you know. So for the price, what do you, think, what do, what do you rate this course? For the price, 42 bucks with a car for 18 holes. Yeah. And and that wasn't a, a deal, that was just their off the rack special. I know on their website, I think for $22 per person, you get nine holes a cart and a drink. So you, there are better deals out there. Yeah. So for 42 bucks for 18 holes on a Monday, it's probably a bit average. I'm not saying that in a bad way, I'm just saying no, because we didn't choose. It's a little bit high, but we didn't choose. Yeah, I think it, it was only gonna be like 18 bucks to walk. The cart is where the money's at, and that's where all the horses make their money. Um, this is why I find it's hard, it's hard to really rate this course compared to something else because there's not enough of these courses around to compare them to other courses. Yeah, but like, you can rate it. Like, well, let's, I, let's, I, let's, let's be honest about yeah. things right now okay. and go, if you're rating this against Gales, yeah. the, the experience helps it because yeah. it's a better experience and you can right. do those things, but obviously it's not, it's not going to be on the same level as Gales no. or Hope Island or something like that. I'd say Gales and Hope Island, they're up sort of 7, 8, yeah. 9 territory. Course itself? Yeah. It's probably a 5 or a 6 out of 10. Yeah. Experience, you're probably to be 8 or 9 because yeah. you're relaxed here. You know that if you're having a bad day, you know the next hole's not going to be a 410 meter par 4 yeah. into the wind. It's probably going to be a 75 meter par 3 into the wind, which yeah. we still struggle with if you watch the vlog. Um, so I, I agree, I totally agree with you. I always say this is a 6 all day long. Yeah. This is a 6 out of 10 all day long, and there's nothing wrong with that because yeah. you can still have more fun on a, on a course yeah. that's a 6 yeah. compared to a course that's a 10 if you can't shoot you know, yeah. well on a 10 like a long linksy style that's course right. where you're going to be hitting fairway drivers and yeah. this is fun. Without courses just, like this yeah. you don't appreciate the other courses and vice versa. Yeah. Because you can come here we were saying you can hone in on your, uh, your short game You can stuff. come here and have a few beers and have a lot of fun. That's right. And you can't do that as much on other courses because we want to play seriously. That's right. And the best part about this course is you don't have the the typical the golfer, you know, yeah. your Saturday comp golfer that, that frowns upon those social guys that come out at 2.30 on a Saturday because it's competition day, yeah. and blah, blah, blah. That's going to probably turn me a few thumbs down, but, you know. No, well, that's the way it is. That's what these courses are for. If you don't like it, go for it. That's right. <laughs>